Hello everyone, in this video I show you how to configure a drone gadget. First of all we need to add data text bar. Here we add experience bar. If you want to see amount of experience over the bar, you need to turn on show text option. But I don't use it. And I um, choose PA experience. I like to make transparent the ground. Now we will add cast bar. You can change texture of the cut bar by choosing any of them with mouse cursor. Else you can switch them which up or down button on the cable. Also, we can change color of the card bar. Our next move will be the red frames. Choose any template. I 
I'm activating the debug mode so I can configure it proper size. By default, codes in debug show not in place, but you can turn them off. To do this, you need to untick show codes or show debug, or both of them. If you want to see how will other template look like, just copy your red frames with copy gadget options and choose another template. Now we will add the unit frames. Choose template you like. Now we will configure the size of the frame. We don't need to add new unit frame and configure it inside each time. We can just copy frame that we already did with copy gadget option. We can enable cut bar to each frame or make separate cut bar. If you delete some elements, you need to log in after that. We also copy frame to the focus and effect. We add range finder.
turn off all unnecessary options. Title, target, name, background. You can change color if you like, usually I do, and don't forget to tick change from color. Copy your image finder and place it over the box. Don't forget to change unit to drag to focus. Now we add target to target frame. choose simply template that have nothing else in because I need only to see both targets. We copy it some way as focus. In the next video, I show you how to add and configure buff in the buff at range. Thank you for watching.